What's up guys this is Sean Heather and in this video we are going to do the review of Huawei MateBook 13 2020 model. So we will talk about its design, performance, features, hardware specs and all of its pros and cons. So let's start it. So first of all let's talk about the design. Huawei MateBook 13 2020 comes with a metallic frame that looks premium. It weighs just 1.3 kg and it is 15mm thin. So it is not the lightest laptop around but 1.3 kg is still not heavy enough and you will be able to carry the laptop anywhere you want without feeling any issue. The matte finish body and the lead of Huawei MateBook 13 looks premium and elegant from every angle. The rounded corners look beautiful and give the device a premium look as well. On the left side there is a USB Type-C port that can be used for charging the laptop and also for the data transfer. Right next to it you will find a 3.5mm audio jack along with an LED indicator. On the right side there is just a USB Type-C 3.1 port provided for data transfer. As you can see there are no legacy ports provided but the good thing is that Huawei provide a USB Type-C to USB-A adapter in the retail box of MateBook 13 and if you buy the high-end version of MateBook 13 2020 with i7 processor then Huawei is going to provide you Huawei Mate Dock 2 docking station for connectivity purpose. The power key provided on the top right corner above the keyboard and the fingerprint sensor is integrated in it. On the right side of the keyboard there is a spot for NFC where you can Use the Huawei Share feature for connecting your smartphone with your MateBook 13 to perform various productivity tasks. The bezels around the screen are quite thin. You will get 88% screen to body ratio and there is one megapixel camera provided right above the screen in the center. There are two speaker grills provided at the bottom of the MateBook 13 and there is a big strip for fan ventilation. Overall the design of Huawei MateBook 13 2020 is really premium and beautiful from every angle. The build quality is great, the smooth edges and curves look beautiful and overall the design got very minimalistic and premium design and look. Talking about the hardware specs, we got three variants of Huawei MateBook 13 2020, i5 with 8GB RAM and integrated GPU, i5 with 8GB RAM and NVIDIA GeForce MX250 GPU and then we got the most high-end variant with i7 processor, 16GB RAM, touch screen and NVIDIA GeForce MX250 GPU. The one we are using in this video for review purpose is the most high-end version with i7 processor. So we got 16GB RAM, 512GB SSD storage, Bluetooth 5 and Wi-Fi AC. It would be nice if Huawei could provide the Wi-Fi 6 capability in the MateBook 13 2020 but unfortunately it is not available on the device. Considering the hardware specs of the Huawei MateBook 13 2020, the performance is going to be quite nice. You will be able to do all of your office work, internet browsing, video streaming, web conferencing without facing any issue. Since it comes with NVIDIA GeForce MX250 GPU, that is a low-end dedicated GPU but better than the integrated GPU. You will be able to do the basic video editing and play some high-end games on low resolution easily. In the benchmarking test we performed on our Huawei MateBook 13 2020 review unit, the performance was quite good and once again the scores gave the idea that you will be able to do all of your regular work on MateBook 13 without facing any issue and you will be able to play some games on it as well. MateBook 13 2020 is a very silent device because there is no moving part in the storage and under the moderate load the fan does not make noise as well but once you start putting pressure on the processor like doing heavy video editing or playing high-end heavy graphics game the device starts heating up and the fan makes lots of noise as well. Also once you start doing heavy work the power consumption reaches 25 watt TDP very quickly and easily. Overall the performance of Huawei MateBook 13 is going to be nice and you will be able to do all kind of work on it without facing any issue. Obviously it is not a gaming laptop so you can't play high and heavy graphics game on the highest possible graphics setting but still you will be able to enjoy them on low resolution for sure. The edge to edge 
chiclet keyboard looks beautiful and performs perfectly as well. The size of the keys are perfect for a 13 inch laptop and you won't feel any issue whether with the keyboard layout, the size of the keys or the functions provided on them. There are three settings for the keyboard backlighting. You can either turn it off, turn it on on medium brightness or at the full brightness. The touchpad is placed in the center and it is big enough to let you use it perfectly without the need of a mouse. The touchpad sensitivity is good and you can use it to zoom in zoom out on the web page that you are browsing. Overall, the experience on the keyboard of Huawei MateBook 13 2020 is going to be a pleasant one. I did not face any issue while using this device as my primary laptop from morning to evening for office purpose while writing blog articles or editing the videos for YouTube channel. The fingerprint sensor embedded in the power key is very responsive and accurate and it lets you directly access the desktop of MateBook 13 without entering the password to log in into your account. And now let's talk about the display quality. MateBook 13 2020 comes with 13 inch IPS touchscreen display with 88% screen to body ratio and the resolution you are going to get is WQHD 2K resolution. So the PPI you will get is 200 and because of that the viewing experience is very nice on MateBook 13. The contrast is good, the color reproduction is so nice. You get sharp images and the 3 is to 2 aspect ratio is perfect for reading and writing. The maximum brightness goes as high as 300 nits and allows you to use the laptop in outdoors and bright sunlight. The touch screen sensitivity is so nice and I did not face any lagging, any difficulty while using it. You can even take a screenshot using the finger gesture on the touch screen of MateBook 13 as it supports 10 point multi touch. So the display quality of MateBook 13 is nice, it's very bright, it's very sharp. The screen of MateBook 13 2020 also comes with eye comfort mode that reduces the blue light coming out from the screen and also adjusts the white balance and the color tone to avoid any stress to your eyes. The speakers at the bottom of MateBook 13 2020 are powerful enough for the entertainment purpose. The audio quality is good, you get lots of bass. And the speakers are loud enough to enjoy the videos without plugging in your headphone to the device. Now talking about the battery life, it comes with 41.7 watt hour battery capacity that provides a good battery life on this device. I was able to use Huawei MateBook 13 2020 from morning to evening for my usual office work plus some YouTube video playback and a bit of music playing. In our non-stop video playback test in which we played full HD resolution video on 50% brightness, the battery survived for nearly 10 hours. And that's not a bad performance for sure. Along with the good battery life, it also comes with 65 watt Huawei Supercharge USB Type-C charger that can charge your device from 0% to 50% in just 30 minutes and up to 100% in a bit more than one hour. This charger is also compatible with few of the Huawei flagship smartphones so you can use the same charger to charge your smartphone and also your laptop. The centrally placed 1MP web camera is perfect for web conferencing and it records good quality video considering its resolution is just 1MP. But the best thing about Huawei MateBook 13 2020 is the productivity. Huawei is also trying to build its own ecosystem based on its devices whether it's wearable products or the laptops or the smartphones. MateBook 13 2020 comes with PC Manager that integrates the Huawei Share feature. Huawei Share lets you see your smartphone on your MateBook 13 screen and control it right from it. You just need to turn on the NFC on your Huawei smartphone and type it on the Huawei Share logo and once connected your smartphone screen will appear on the MateBook 13 screen and then you can control your smartphone from your MateBook 13. You can even transfer the files between these two devices without any physical connection and just by dragging and dropping the files from smartphone window to the laptop window and from laptop window to the smartphone window. This surely improves the productivity a lot. The PC manager provides lots of options to improve the performance of MateBook 13. You can also install the drivers right from the PC manager application. You can also improve the battery life using the power management option in the PC manager. 
or you can just run a checkup whether all of the hardware on your MateBook 13 are working properly or not. Once your Huawei smartphone is connected to the PC Manager, you can use the one-hop option to transfer files between the devices. You can use the multi-screen collaboration that we have just talked about and you can even take the backup of your multimedia content to keep them safe. You can even take a screenshot on your MateBook 13 2020 using your three fingers on the touch screen. The built-in OCR also detects whatever is written on the picture and then it provides you lots of options to edit the screenshot that you have captured. Overall, Huawei MateBook 13 2020 is a great 13-inch laptop in every aspect. The design and build quality is premium, elegant and minimalistic. It looks beautiful from every angle and it feels good as well while working on this laptop. The screen is gorgeous with good contrast great color reproduction and good amount of maximum brightness. The touch screen sensitivity is nice. The fingerprint sensor embedded in the power key works perfectly and accurately each time. The battery life is good and the 65W charger works perfectly to quickly charge the MateBook 13 battery. The overall performance of MateBook 13 2020 is pretty nice. You will be able to do all of your user work without facing lag or any kind of issue and you will be able to do some video editing and gaming as well very smoothly thanks to NVIDIA GeForce MX250 GPU. So if you're planning to buy a nice 13 inch laptop then Huawei MateBook 13 2020 is a very nice option currently available in the market. And good part is that Huawei Saudi Arabia is also providing 1500 worth of free gift with Huawei MateBook 13. So that's all for now friends. Thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed this, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, subscribe the channel and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notification for future uploads and I'll see you guys next time in an another video. Have a nice day.